محمد علي كان يو اوكي البرزنتر هير بليز explain the these are the outer sepals they protect the flowers as it blooms inside more these are the petals they attract pollinators and animal pollinated plants because they're colorful yeah but then once we go deeper these small stalks are the answers uh, the top is the answer the bottom is the filament together they form the stamen then more at the center Yes. This two part, this is the stigma connected to the style and the ovary at the bottom over here. All of them form the, the carpel, multiple carpels form the pistol. Okay, thank you, thank you, excellent. Okay, I'm gonna move to another group. Okay, Hi Okay, will the leader have this group? Uh, I guess I am, yeah. You're gonna be the leader? Yes. Okay. Represent the flower, please. Okay, Go so here you, here we have the petals which yeah. can attract animal pollinators. Yes. And then if you look here, there's these long filaments, which have anthers on top, which can produce pollen grains. Yeah. And in the middle, there's uh, so this is a stamen. Yeah. The filament and the pollen grains. I got some. And the middle is the carpel. On top is the stigma with the sticky tip, so it can keep the pollen on it. And then, like, the thing that connects, then, the, then like, the, this thing is the, called the style, which connects it to the ovary on the bottom. Okay, thank you, thank you. Very, very good. Thank you. Okay, now here, who gonna be the representative in this group? Right, okay, go ahead, Ray. Here we have the petals. Petals are usually brightly colored. They're scented and they have guidelines in order to attract the pollinators. Yeah. Now the male structures are the anthers and the filaments. Yeah. The anthers produce pollen grains that land on the stigma, which is sticky, and then the female parts are the uh, are the stigma style and the ovary those are the carpels when the pollen grains land on the stigma the tube self helps in forming the pollen tube which goes down to the microbial into the ovary where, where fertilization occurs okay thank you okay thank you the last group please who's gonna be a representative here thank you Go ahead. So right here, these are the set. Yeah. They protect the flower before the plant blooms. Yes, right. And uh, over here, these are the petals. They're, they're used to attract the uh, animals. Like yeah. they can take the pollen and transfer. Actually, the insects. Or pollinate. Yeah, yeah. pollinate. Okay. So that they could take the pollen from the anther, which is the male organ, yeah. or this, yeah. uh, to other plants so that they can pollinate. Okay. And uh, right here, these are the anthers. Yes. And uh, these anthers are the male parts that have filament, uh, that have the uh, The male filament. parts of the stamen, they're made up of anther, just pointed, which is the pollen producing yeah. organ. And then it's hanged by a filament. Filament. Okay, These stalk like. The yeah, great. Part. Yeah. And right yeah. here, this is the female organ. This is the uh, yeah. stigma. Right okay. Here. And the stigma is the part that takes in the pollen. Yeah. Uh, and the thing that holds up the stigma is called the style. Okay, thank you. Thank you a lot. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Brett. 12 a.m. Okay. Thank you, all of you.